guys welcome to another video i am in berlin right now for the new year this year and i'm at the hauptbahn of it is the central station of berlin and it's decorated for the christmas I have to catch a uh, train in about 8 minutes so I have to move quickly right now one of uh, in Berlin and they have a tram stop which is like a street train so that is built on top of this building so it is pretty cool so now the train is moving there's some good, there's some good engineering there look at the rooftop it's beautiful came out of the train station and uh, we have realized that Berlin looks exactly like Frankfurt and that was quite disappointing yeah, so it's all we are totally yeah yeah, hello. 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 This You're a is YouTuber. Yeah. Right, we're going, man. <laughs> <laughs> hello. This is uh, Ashi. And uh, yeah, what's your? Seriously? Out? So you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm uploading. Seriously? <laughs> yeah. If if you give me permission, I'll upload. Otherwise, I can't upload. Look <laughs> at the architecture of this building. Uh, yeah. Looks like some different kind of architecture it's cool so yeah as I was telling we are a total of 12 people who have planned the, this trip uh, God, it's another windy day I'm sorry if the audio is again spoiled by the wind and we are going to this restaurant uh, to this Indian restaurant called the Amrit Lounge so if you are in and around Hauptbahnhof you can also come and visit I mean I have not tried the food yet I'll, I'll also tell the reviews of the, uh, the dishes which I have in the restaurant and we'll see how it goes so this is inside an Indian restaurant here in Berlin they have some pretty cool stuff See this fountain here and let's go inside. Uh, this restaurant looks pretty cool. They have put some Indian music too. Look at these lightings. They look pretty nice. They could have used some other kind of bulb. Some, could have saved some power but they have gone for this because we go for the aesthetics over money in this stuff so I just finished uh, I mean we just finished the lunch at lunch here at uh, with the restaurant so we'll hear about the experiences of uh, my friends uh, 
regarding Rashmi, their yeah, yeah. lunch. Yeah. So yeah, this is Rashmi. Can you please tell how the food was? Yeah, it was very tasty. If you yeah. people are coming to Berlin, do visit this restaurant. It's very nice Indian food. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and they, and they say spicy, but it's not that spicy. Yeah, it's it's not that spicy, so, obviously. Yeah, <laughs> but it's good. Yeah. Is it? Muttu. Abi, how was the non-veg food? Non-veg food was very nice, uh, and uh, wasn't that spicy enough? But yeah, the okay. taste was very nice. Yeah. So, how, how much do you give it out of five? Out of five, I will give it around three point five. Ah, okay, that's very nice then. Okay, so this is Pradeep. So he is from Chennai, Chennai Paya, and uh, he has a couple of dialogues uh, which, are, which have become quite famous uh, throughout the group. You do you want to tell the, the dialogue? So yeah, I mean uh, he he has uh, a dialogue called Jing and uh, Takita Takita. <laughs> so that has become quite famous today in, in uh, yeah. Like it was supposed to be. You should only do it. Listen, all I'll cut. <laughs> ah, see, there it comes. <laughs> Yeah, he's quite camera shy, this guy. This train is pretty full right now. It's like Bangalore Metro. Hello guys, welcome back and uh, we are just strolling through the streets of Checkpoint Charlie and the speciality about this place is that it has a historic significance. Um, seems that uh, this, uh, the place is where the Russians and the US uh, were in Cold War and the espionages were, you know, traded at this point. <laughs> it has some significance uh, during that period of time. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, this is the busy city of Berlin. Oh, as you can see, there are a lot of people. Yeah, in yeah, Berlin. Yeah, this is like uh, or there are just market. Seven in the morning. So many people. <laughs> you know the architectures uh, yeah, of these buildings remind me of the city of Madrid when I went there this summer. The architecture of the building is quite similar. So, as you guys can see, this is the checkpoint of the US Army. This was used uh, during the Cold War uh, between the US and Russia. So, Berlin is uh, you know, quite an important place when you see the historic significance of it. So, this is a uh, a guy who looks like a Russian, not sure his position. 
Yeah. There are a lot of historic uh, photos kept right here. And the Berlin Wall, or rather the replica of the Berlin Wall is right here. Yeah, the, this point, which is called a checkpoint Charlie, was you know, pivotal, uh, not pivotal, but uh, significant location for in those days during Cold Wars because the US and the Russian uh, military uh, exchanged uh, some espionages which, which are uh, some important people who can make a difference in those times. So they used to exchange uh, those kind of peoples here at this point. So it feels pretty cool to be at this exact place which was kind of like this, uh, like this. We have landed now in the East Germany and we are currently going to the East Side Gallery. It's the East Side Gallery. Um, yeah, this is also one of the monuments of those uh, period. As you can see, there's an Indian flag here. I don't know why exactly. And someone has written something like. Amrit and Amma and all. So, looks like the Indians have not left this fall also. And they have joined the party with the Germans. Cool. So, we are now going to see Berlin's uh, Rahul Dravid. Uh, aka the Berlin Wall. Mm. In this what happened? No gun shoot and all in the toilet. Where man? <laughs> Where did the gun shoot happen? <laughs> so this is uh, here we are at uh, the Berlin Wall. Uh, we actually thought the wall outside the gate was the actual Berlin Wall. So someone guided us here. So thank you for that person. So this is pretty dark here, but I'm trying to put the torch and make you guys visible. Some of the photos they have posted here of, I don't know, maybe some of the people who were involved the destruction of the wall or something and this is the actual wall which was destroyed for the unification of the West and East Germany or not I actually slept for half an hour in a party which looked like this
So yeah, I, I we came back to Darmstadt, which is where I'm studying right now, and uh, yeah, the trip is officially over, and I'm now going to my friend's place. So yeah, that that was it. It was pretty good. Uh, the party at Berlin. Um, you know, people from all over the world will come to party at Berlin uh, during New Year. It didn't. It didn't disappoint uh, me actually. So it was pretty good. So I hope this video was uh, more entertaining than the previous one. So be sure to comment out uh, the stuff which you want more in the video, or uh, the stuff if you want something less in the video, you can also comment that. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Be sure to like, share and subscribe to the channel. And uh, yeah, just spread the vlog uh, to your friends if you can, if you think the video is good. So yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video right here. So here's uh, wishing to you a very happy new year, very happy 2020. I hope it's going to bring uh, a lot of dreams into reality for you guys and uh, yeah, till next time, peace out.